How's it going, everybody? Welcome back to my channel. And in this video, I'm going to do a reaction to the Bee Gees. This is where I came in. This is like a super new song. This one was released in 2001, and I don't know it because I was too young to be caring about the Bee Gees at the time. Um, it was recommended to me by MJ97, and I'm assuming MJ97, you're part of that like 24% of the population of my subscribers who are like my age. Because the majority of you guys are older than me. So, um, this one wasn't a huge hit. Um, it got to... Where was it? Alright, it got to 18 in the UK. And it also reached number 25 in Germany. And 23 on the Billboard Adult Contemporary Charts in the United States. So it didn't chart very high. But this is the fifth decade of the Bee Gees recording. And I cannot emphasize to you how much that is impressive that you can be recording music for five decades. Like, like is Taylor, there's a question right there. Is Taylor Swift going to be recording music in three decades? I don't, I, 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 I don't see that happening. There's gonna be somebody else who's gonna be really weird, who's gonna probably be more popular. Um, anyways, this one is super new. So I'm excited to see how this is because I'm kind of used to the OPG stuff. With that, with that, if you haven't done so, please smash the like button. Uh, it's up to my channel, and let's get started. I've seen this story, I read it over once or twice. I said that you say a little bit of bad advice I've been in trouble, it happened to me all my life I lie and you lie, and who would get the sharpest knife? Who no, should be somebody like that? But the kind of man to throw his head into the ring and Go down without following through, the day turns into night To black and white under the bed clothes everything will be all right i know that you know nothing ever stays the same said so i said so love will never speak its name we're gonna find somebody like you maybe with a brain and a body too you could never make a move on a woman that leaves me on you got a little bit of something for everyone it's a little too late and the wolf is on the run Fall apart and watch you 
Oh, super interesting. Oh, very interesting. Man, sorry, my thoughts are kind of everywhere on this one. Um, I don't know how many thoughts I have on this one, but I'll just start speaking number one, I guess. Um, you know, this song, I think it's good enough in, in the 2000s, 2001. That's good enough. Actually, I, no, I mean, I'm not supposed to react to these ones because it's a super new song, right? Um, this is good enough. Like, I feel like... This should be good enough to have been mainstream popular, you know? I guess, I mean, I, I guess during all the boy bands and Britney Spears' time, I guess maybe this wasn't, they weren't young enough? I don't know. I don't know. The, what I'm trying to get at is this song is definitely good enough that it could have been popular at the time. I'm not sure why I don't know it. I've never heard of it. Uh, number two, I, I feel like this song, they've definitely adapted to the 2000s if you, if you just look at it. Um, if you had just taken away the whole, if I just been listening to this on the radio, like you could have totally convinced me that this is a new popular band. But I feel like if you look at them, they're just very young. You know, they're just very young. In the video itself, they're kind of running around. You know, that's not like my my picture of the Bee Gees, to be quite honest. So it's a uh, it's very different. They've adapted uh, to the music style in the two thousands. So I guess it's really interesting to see their 80s stuff, you know, their 90s stuff, and now their 2000s. You know, five decades is what they've gone through. And I guess that's kind of part of that. It's that evolution of getting better music. So I'll just leave you with those two thoughts. Uh, but yeah, I think this is a good song. I, I think this could have definitely been popular in the 2000s. You guys can tell me what you guys think about it. Um, as for lyrics, I think this chorus here is really good. Uh, where is it? This is the danger zone. This is where I came in. They know not what they do, forgive them all their sins. They know they cannot take away what you have given me. Uh, super, super good, super good. But yeah, overall, man, that's interesting. I, I, tell me what you guys think about this, though. Like, this song, was it popular in the 2000s and I just haven't heard it? But I totally feel like this could have been, like, on MTV and I would have watched it. And I would have been like, oh yeah, this is, like, you know, a popular song right now. Like, I could have totally picked myself for listening to it on the radio. Or did I just not hear it? Tell me in the comments below. If you haven't already done so, please smash that like button and sub to my channel. I'll see you guys in the next video.